Hey Ryan, it's Linda here, reading for the role of Melanie. Hey there, stranger! I feel like I haven't seen you in forever. So what? It'd still be nice to have you drop by. Did you do something to your hair? It looks different. Hmm. Looks good. I wanted to ask you something. Did you get Alvin a birthday present yet? I know it's a couple of weeks away, but I just wanted to make sure we both didn't get him the same gift again. Wow, that really cheapens my gift. I know you two played the new version, but this is the one we played as kids. I thought it would be cool, but now I'm starting to think it's pretty lame. You're not just saying that. But that's you. You're always happy with anything. Okay, I trust you. We should get together and play sometime. Hey, do you want to grab some food? <laughs> no, no, she seems fun. I guess that means you're free? Mmm, so good. I haven't had a cheat day in so long. I'm going to regret this. It's all gonna go straight to my ass. You know Alvin, he loves his girl Thin. You heard we're back together, right? We're more than... <laughs> Remember when we used to marathon all those 90s TV, so TV shows? What happened? Why don't we do stuff like that anymore? Or you're too busy with other girls? Wait! Are you actually seeing someone? Oh my god, when did this happen? Who is she? How did you meet? Oh, you got something on your face? So what were we saying? Sorry, one sec. Hi Stephanie, how are you doing? I'm fine, thank you. Right now? Yeah, sure. I can be there in 15 minutes. Okay, I'll see you soon. Bye now. Sorry to do this to you, but I gotta meet a client. I've been trying to sell this condo for weeks now, and this is the first real shot. I wanna hear all about this girl tomorrow. Oh, hey, I was just about to go for a run. No, it's all right. The park isn't going anywhere. And what happened to you yesterday? You said you were going to get some air, but never came back. You what? What do you mean? <laughs> I don't know if this is some kind of joke. How long? Since high school? When I left that letter for you in the locker? So why was Alvin at the temple that night instead of you? You heard us outside of the school, didn't you? And you told him to go to the temple. So typical of you! Always putting the needs of others before your own. All these years you had me believing I was nothing more to you than just a friend. Well, you're too late. 
know that you see this, it means Alvin and I are committed to each other. You mean all those girls he's been with when we were on a break? Yeah, I know about them and so did you. But you never told me. You say you love me, but you couldn't even do what was right. And only now when you want to break things up with Alvin and me, you're bringing these things up. You should have told me a long time ago. But you didn't because you choose bros over hoes, right? He's promised me that he will no longer fool around with other women. He even told me about a woman named Janet from a few days ago. So I believe he truly wants to make a change. You should have fought for me. Like I said, it's too late.